Hey guys, so I'm in Manda Wildlife Reserve. Um, it's a beautiful reserve. It's a vast area covered uh, in Singapore and it's considered to be one of the world famous. Um, this is a place where you get lots and lots of wildlife, um, you know, across the country um, from Africa, from Ethiopia, from Amazon, from India, you know, and also from other countries. Okay, so as you enter the Mandai Wildlife Reserve, uh, we have three entrances. One is for that goes towards the Singapore um, Zoo, and the other one which goes towards the River Wonders, and the third one which goes towards the Night Safari part. And just next to that, if you just go few kilometers, you will also get the Bird Paradise. So I'm in Mandai Wildlife Reserve now, and as you enter, immediately you'll find this beautiful cement. It's one among the lesser apes okay and this is commonly found in malaysian indonesia forest beautiful creature uh, they got their uh, epiglottis like you know when they aren't it, it just gets swollen i mean it's a beautiful creature here we go with the majesty the white tiger beautiful white tiger couple of them, a mating pair. Hey guys, so here we have the creature called Babirusa. Babirusa is basically a pig deer, we call it as. Um, it's just like, like you know, wild Indian boar. But in uh, this you know, Malaysian species, we can, for the male, we can easily see the tusk growing through their snout. Beautiful creature. And so what we have got here now is rock hyrax. Rock hyrax is just behind me. Uh, it belongs to a squirrel family, uh, but pretty uh, bluffy um, than the normal squirrels. Uh, this is normally found in South Africa actually. It's a pretty cute animal, uh, not much active, but very cute animal, yeah. So the best part uh, in Mandai uh, Wildlife Reserve, we have a lot of uh, you know, vendor machines, automated vendor machines where you can uh, get drinks, where you can get some snacks, you can, you have all the drinks here to keep yourself hydrated, which is much helpful for me because I have been trekking right from morning 9 o'clock and I have to uh, reach the exit gate by 6 and covering this entire area, uh, you know, filming the entire um, wildlife in the short span of time, really a challenging one. You can find a lot of vendor machines here. We got all types of drinks, we got snacks, fresh juice and all those things. We got some ice cream as well. So you can just keep yourself, uh, you know, um, appetite with all those uh, brunches and as well as with <coughs> whatever the munches you want to like, you would like to have and the drink as well. So I'm currently in the zone of primate kingdom. Uh, we have got Columbus monkey, we have got orangutans here, um, we have got lemurs here, um, we have got um, no, uh, proboski monkeys, everything. So let me see how much I could find out. Okay, so this is D brass monkey. Normally, um, it's also found in Africa. Okay guys, so we have got the proboski monkey here. Proboski monkey is normally found uh, in the Malaysia Indonesia border. It's a beautiful creature and they are known, well known for their nose, which is pretty long. It's a beautiful, uh, you know, apes, uh, primates you can say.
I'm just standing next to the waterfall here, which is inside the Manda Wildlife Reserve. It's a beautiful rainy day also, and I could see a lot of uh, baboons, you know, roaming around this uh, in a free range uh, near to this waterfall. These baboons are actually, um, you know, mostly they are found in the region, Great Rift Valley of Ethiopia, and you could see a lot of them. But they are quite busy in you know having their breakfast, I believe. Okay, so we have got ring-tailed lemur. Lemur is normally found in Madagascar. It's a very soft creature. You can see it's always playful. Okay, so we are here at the orangutan uh, spot. Uh, these orangutans are from Sumatra and you can see the orangutans here. They are pretty playful in nature. We, we can find orangutans in Sumatra, we can find orangutans in, also in ba uh, Borneo. Uh, these orangutans are um, very active, always they are playful and active. Um, they do a lot of acrobatic uh, activities always, you can see here. Orangutans are actually uh, active uh, creatures. Um, they always, uh, you know, do some kind of activity, some kind of, you know, acrobatic activities. Always, uh, you can see them here. Um, they are very playful uh, and quite active as well. Okay, so right next to me, uh, we have got this A Mangrove restaurant. Amag restaurant serves Indian food, local cuisine as well as the European dishes. Um, you can see, uh, you will get biryanis, you will get tandoori's, you will get um, the local cuisine foods and everything here. Barbecue chickens and everything. You can see the menu here. Menu is displayed here. Okay, so we have got sun beers here, which is Malayan sun beers. And this is highly endangered species, high risk of uh, extinct in the wild. Uh, it's getting extinct uh, very fast actually. Uh, they've got it preserved pretty uh, in a pretty good um, environment. You know, it has, they have given a very good habitat for the sun beer. Okay, so now I'm going to enter into the zone. The zone name is Reptopia. I'm pretty excited for the zone because I am in love with iguana, and there are a lot of iguanas as well as monte lizard which are pretty colorful and I love them, I actually love them. So I'm pretty excited to get into this zone. The zone name is Reptopia. Okay, so we are in the spot now where we can see Komodo dragon. And Komodo dragons are, um, you know, we can normally find in Indonesia. There's a, a place called Komodo Island. Uh, where there are a lot of Komodo dragon in the wild. Um, this is one of the extinct species. You can see one Komodo dragon here. They are venomous. Um, they actually bite the prey and the prey cannot survive for long. Uh, and then it will, um, with its uh, smelling skill, like you know, it track the prey again and then it uh, eat the flesh of the prey. So that's how it hunts.
So I am inside this um, Reptopia zone in Mandai Wildlife Reserve. It's one of the beautiful zone. Uh, they've got multiple varieties of snakes, reptiles, iguana, chameleons, um, and you need to look into the colors of iguanas. They've got multicolor iguanas, you know, I mean, they got these reptiles uh, from different parts of the world, uh, well maintained in the natural habitat, um, beautiful zone. So we got a predator from Madagascar here. This is called Fosa. It basically uh, feeds on uh, another you know, um, favorite food is gonna be uh, lemur. Um, it's mainly found in uh, Madagascar, and they are uh, one of the well-known uh, predator in Madagascar. Okay, so we have got giraffes here. This is a spot where you can find giraffe. You can find some leopard and also lion. Just opposite to the giraffe, you have got lion. Okay, so now I'm in the spot. This is an African zone, and here you can find this African lion. Um, we've got one African lion and two lioness. And just next to that, in the opposite, you can find giraffes. So what you can see behind me is another primate. Uh, this is red-capped monkey um, from Africa region. It's in the high risk of extinct. Uh, we have only very few species um, in the world. Um, it's in the very, very high risk of extinct. And it's a beautifully, uh, you know, it has got a kind of a red hat. Uh, and so the name is uh, called as red-capped uh, monkey. So what you can see behind me is simpanjis. Uh, they have been brought from African region. Uh, normally, simpanjis are found in Uganda. Uh, even the gorillas are found in Uganda and Rwanda. Simpanjis are also found in Uganda, Rwanda, and they are actually a great ape. They are also called to be a brainy ape because they do a lot of things. Um, you know, resembles to a lot of activities what we human do, like uh, laugh while playing, you know, clapping hands, and all those things. <laughs> 